kitchen. Now on this week's video tutorial I really wanted to do another cupcake related video tutorial for you so I'm going to show you how to make these really pretty mini rose cupcakes and these are made to look like little bouquets of flowers in individual cupcakes so you've got the mini roses and you've got these really sweet flower buds and they're finished off with some buttercream leaves okay let's get started the things that we're going to need to actually make the cupcakes is firstly i've got my cupcakes here and i've got a batch of vanilla buttercream i've split it out into four different batches and two of those batches i've colored in pink now this one is just slightly lighter than this one and we're going to use those two for the roses i've then got a batch of green and one that i've just kept neutral i've then got my spatulas here and my piping bags now lastly i've got the piping tips that i'm going to use today okay so the first one that i'm going to use for the roses is this closed star tip which is a number 34 now you can also find this in some brands it comes under a number 35 but as you can see it's just got this star tip at the top okay so the second one that i'm actually going to use is this leaf tip and this is the number 352 i've then got two round end tips and these are a number three and a number two Okay, so the first thing that we're gonna do is prepare my cupcake. So I've got here just one of the pink colors of buttercream and I'm just gonna take a small amount of that and just pop it on the top of the cupcake just to create a small dome on the top there. And this is just gonna make the roses sit in a small dome shape rather than sitting flat. I'm then gonna take the two different shades of pink buttercream that I've got and fill those in a piping bag with my number 34 tip. Just to trim the end off the piping bag, open that out and drop the piping tip in there and make sure that that is quite tight on the bottom. I then just place that into glass put the light pink buttercream on one side and the dark pink buttercream on the other okay so I've got my piping bag here and I'm just gonna hold this in my right hand and just apply pressure to the end okay so on my cupcake I want to create three roses so I'm just gonna pick one side to start with I'm just gonna create swirls by starting from the inside and just swirling around And when you're done, you just want to pull off, create this rose design. Now I'm going to create two more of those. So one just next to that. So I'm just going to fill this gap on the other side with the third rose. Okay, so there we have the three roses. I want to turn this into a flower bouquet. So I'm going to add some flower buds so all i've done is first of all put some of my green icing into the number three piping tip so what i'm going to do to fill the gaps is just put my piping nozzle to it just squeeze until you get a ball and then once i'm finished let go of the pressure and just pull off and i'm just going to create a few of those to fill these spaces and i'm going to put some on the top and some around the other side okay so the green parts are actually going to be the petals that surround the buds so what i've got here is the number two piping tip with just the white kind of normal buttercream and then starting with one of these balls i'm just going to place the piping tip slightly inside so i'm going to push it inside one of the green balls and then apply pressure to create these flower buds so again just on one of the balls i'm just going to take the end of the piping tip and push that slightly against the green ball that we made apply pressure to the bag and then once i'm happy with the size i'm just going to stop applying pressure and pull away so i'm just going to do that for the rest of the buds <laughs> Okay, so to finish the cupcake off, I'm gonna take my leaf piping tip. Now this is the 352, which I've just filled with the rest of the green buttercream. Okay, so on this piping tip, you actually have a V cut out. Now you wanna make sure that the V is actually at the side. So it's the two points that are at the top and the bottom. So you just wanna lay that against your cupcake, apply some pressure, and then just pull off. And that's gonna create this leaf effect. So I'm gonna go around the cupcake and just add these in, filling up any additional spaces that we still had left. 
okay so there we have the finished cupcakes which have these roses and make it look like a little bouquet in one cupcake now these can be made in any color and you can have any color buds that you like i really hope you've enjoyed this video tutorial and if you have then don't forget to give this video a like and if you'd like to see more videos like this then please subscribe also don't forget to follow me on instagram and facebook and check out the cakes by lynn's blog i'll put all the links below bye